free. Download Friday. Trap Tendo. What is going on, peoples? Free Download Friday. I'm DJ F here. This is your favorite day and my favorite day, and we are checking out Spitfire Audios Labs. I don't know why in the world I didn't check this out before. But anyway, so what I'm gonna do here is leave a link in the description box. I wanna hear your comments, how you feel about it, which ones are your favorite. And I'm gonna show you how to install it and preview some of the sounds and try to cook up something with it. So without any more ado, let's go. So here we are, when you visit that link, it will look like this right here. And this is the text that you need to read. And it says, need help getting started? You will need Spitfire Audio app in order to get labs. Download for Mac here, download for Windows here. So since I have Windows, I will download it here. And it's already over here. So the next thing I'm gonna do is this. So simply, I'm just gonna click on the execution file. It's gonna bring me to this screen here to give permissions. And now I'm just gonna click next. And next, I'm gonna go ahead and create a desktop shortcut just to make sure. And then I'm gonna click install. So there you have it right here. And then it says launch Spitfire Audio. Boom, so boom, finished. And now here we are. So I gotta log in real quick. So if you don't mind, I'll put in my passwords and stuff. And if you don't have one, make sure that you create an account. Once you're logged in, it will ask you for a default content path. You can choose whatever. I'm just gonna keep it the same here. I'm cool with that. And then it will tell you if you want your VST to be 32 bit. And I'm gonna go ahead and keep that the way it is. And then for VST2 install path, I'll keep it on the 64 bit right here. I'm good with that right there. So let's go ahead and do that. And then it will tell you which ones do you want to install, which whatever size, which, yeah, they got a whole bunch of free stuff here. So let me go ahead and do that. And I'll see you in a little bit. Do keep in mind, I think some of these are not free, but the ones that obviously say free on there, they're free. So, you know, I'm just checking them out and downloading stuff as much as humanly possible. And, and then I'm gonna install them but there are some that aren't free, it looks like. I'm not sure yet, we'll find out more a little later. Now we're in the MPCB software, let's go ahead and uh, go over here to the plugins over here, and uh, we're gonna load stuff up. Let's see, so I, all I have to do is just look for labs. It is under labs here, so go to labs, select it. Now I have labs, open it up, and this is how it looks like here so it is vectoral and it does stretch out so that's pretty cool uh, now let's hear some of the sounds here So I'm gonna cheat a little bit. I'm gonna use the MPC's built-in scales and stuff like that, because why not? I mean, if you have those tools, why not use them? So I'm gonna go ahead and activate it. Go into progressions here and just dig into my large pool of progressions that I have here.
now that I play with it a little bit here, I can tell you some cool things that I've seen. So clicking on this obviously will bring up the preset window and you can preview sounds and stuff like that. For some reason it doesn't work on mine, but that's cool. But you can see all the stuff that I got and that's all the stuff that you will have if you download everything that you want or whatever. And then you also have where you can start stuff because you can save your favorite presets and it'll go on to start and you can check out different things, of course, by their category. So that's pretty cool by laps there. And then if you want to load the sound in, you just hit load and it's there. And all this is this means right here is areas where there is nothing in the key group in itself because this essentially can just play ROMs or, or samples and stuff like that, just like the NPC in itself. So that's pretty cool, right? And other things about this I really like is just the fact that uh, you can hit this middle knob right here and you can control the parameters. So you can control like the reverb and the attack, the decay, the sustain, the release, and you know, but that's pretty much it. So tell me how you feel about this. I definitely wanna hear from you guys in the comment section, which is your favorite Spitfire Labs free download? Because I thought it was pretty cool. Uh, I don't know why, again, I don't know why I haven't checked this out before. I think it always be in the back of my mind or it be in the front of my mind and something happens like that. I don't know, I'm, I'm a little <laughs> bipolar. <laughs> oh my God. But other than that though, hopefully you enjoyed it and I will see you next time.